Hi everyone, it's Gary here at Kuzai. Today I'm just going to show you how to find the e-commerce uh, data layer and variables within that. Uh, just on a couple of example websites. So uh, here I'm using Chrome and the uh, probably easiest way is using a data layer checker uh, plugin such as this one. Um, so once that's installed, you can just sort of go to your uh, product page or um, checkout page and then you'll be able to find um, the product data in here. So here we've got like the uh, product description and uh, currency and those sorts of things. Um, then once it's added to your bag, um, I've chosen your size, you'll be able to see a bit more. I've also got another example here with the uh, basket page. So again, just click on the plugin at the top and you can see that view cart, all the value, currency, product information, all that sort of thing. Uh, so that's all in there. Obviously, there are a few more um, data layer variables within here, but um, luckily, this kind of uh, uses that color coding so you can see the e commerce stuff. Um, you can also do that manually. So just go back to this, and if you inspect and go to console. Um, type in data layer, return on there. You'll be able to see basically everything that that, that the plugin was showing, but uh, it's in a less user friendly way. Um, so on here, I think it's this one with the uh, e commerce and the currency code and everything. Um, so all the information is within here, um, like the details on the uh, name and what the product is, uh, price, that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, that will be comparable to what you see in here. These uh, plugins are just showing it in a nicer way. So um, yeah, hopefully that lets you find the data layer variables when you need to. Thanks.